Hello, I'm Scott Duke, and welcome to Food As I See It. Hello, I'm Scott Duke with the Food As I See It blog. It's what we ate week, Darnell week at Rockfish at Mockingbird Station. We're at Sync Lab Media, our sponsor. My co-host today with me is Mark Neese. And I'm still here. And he's I, still The here. third day. Hasn't moved. Third day and I'm still here. Hasn't yeah. moved a bit. I mean, <laughs> anchored. Um, this is Wednesday. We called it Tough Choice Wednesday because, as we mentioned, this is Darnell week. I uh, challenge Darnell, which I do a lot, on providing me something different. And for those of you who have not tuned in yet, Darnell is our awesome server at Rockfish. He we is. always request to actually. We just walk in and sit down, and he serves us. So that's it's, that's, it's a, that's the kind of clout we have. Phenomenal! Yeah. You, you got to check this out. So tough choice Wednesday, challenging Darnell on what he thinks between the two things I chose or chose to, for him to choose for me was between the catfish basket and fish and chips. He came out with fish and chips, folks. And I've had the fish and chips before, so it wasn't a real surprise, but it is a quality meal. And one thing I liked about the fish and chips, um, he he provided me with, instead of the French fries that come in the basket, it came with the rocking green beans, which are very well-prepared green beans with some small new potatoes mixed in with, with it. So it's not like you're, you're missing out on the potatoes. And some onion there, too. And some onion. Caramelized very, very, onion, green very beans. Tasty, very tasty. Potatoes. It's a very fresh Alaskan rocking. cod. A huge portion came out. And, uh, again, this is customizable. If you wanted to try to get this meal like you wanted, ask for the fish and chips like you wanted. And, again, it's a very affordable meal at $8.99. Mark, what would you have? Well, I was leaning toward the fish and chips before we ever walked in because you made me eat healthy on Monday. Instead of having my basket on Monday, I was thinking about the fish and chips also. Right. So I gave him the same choice, fish and chips or seafood enchiladas. I'd never, and we've been there how many times? I've never, never had, had the seafood never enchiladas before. And uh, so I think Darnell actually knew that. And so since he was bringing you the fish and chips, he brought me the seafood enchiladas, and they were awesome. They looked good. And by the way, I had them with the rock and green beans also. There we you go. Just, you, can't, you can't pass up the rock and green beans. No, you can't. Yeah, they're, they're awesome. So... Um, the seafood enchiladas, they've got, uh, uh, probably have some of the Alaskan cod in it. They've got the smaller shrimp, the lump crab meat, uh, and uh, I think that's the only three types of seafood that are in it. Mm-hmm. Uh, but the sauce is, man, that made the whole thing. And the sauce is like a, um, kind of like a uh, chipotle kind of uh, remoulade kind of sauce to it, so it's a little bit tangy, but has a little bit of spice to it. Two enchiladas, right? Uh, actually, it was three. Three, three enchiladas, enchiladas and corn tortillas. So that's the other thing. The corn is a really good, nice flavor yeah. instead of flour, and makes them a little bit lighter. And then uh, some uh, fresh sliced jalapeno on the top. And that this, that that spices it up. In a great just, value, uh, just a great enough. Value. Yeah, and those are only ten ninety nine. I mean, you can't yeah. you know you can't really go wrong with Again, that. Again, so. another great meal, a great Wednesday lunch for tough choice. Darnell did a great job on choosing them. I suggest you try this out. We're going to be back tomorrow with Thursday. Yeah, go to Rockfish, go see Darnell, and test him. True. Right, so. Yeah, give him a. Make him make him choose. Between challenge two him. Drinks for challenge him. Yeah. You won't be. You won't. Be, he's never wrong. <laughs> so we'll be back for Thursday, and so stay tuned. We'll be right back. Food as I see it.